Good morning, I'm meteorologist Larry Rice. High pressure is still in control of the western third of the country, and that means mild temperatures will continue all the way up into the weekend. We can use the word warm all the way till Friday, and the cold weather in the east and the possibility of some really nasty storms in the mid-Atlantic region. Look at the 84 in L.A., 72 for San Francisco, 51 in Denver, but only 30s. From Chicago on up toward Cleveland, about 50, but some snow in the forecast there as we head toward the late evening hours. And this is quite a storm. Strong winds, heavy snows on the backside of the low, and out ahead of it, Virginia and the Carolinas under the threat of significant Thunderstorms that may produce more damaging tornadoes, seven reported in the Gulf Coast region with several fatalities. The West, very quiet weather coming up, and that's the way we expect it to be all the way through the weekend, but that's one area of the nation that we're going to keep our eye on for uh, this afternoon and this evening. Our friends across Montana and Wyoming enjoying another glorious day today and tomorrow. And why don't we throw Friday in there as well? However, a change coming up as we head toward Saturday that will include a chance of some passing showers. But the biggest thing you'll notice this weekend is the wind. Now, our forecast numbers for today go from the mid-30s all the way to the mid-40s. Overnight temperatures, Thursday morning, it's going to be a very crisp, beautiful morning, but it's going to be chilly, teens and 20s. In the seven-day forecast, we continue the warm-up right into the weekend. Awesome Friday, 59, sunshine, and then as we head toward the afternoon on Saturday, the winds pick up, temperature drops to 55 on Sunday, and a chance of showers lingering through Monday and Tuesday, but it's only a slight chance of showers.